Hello everybody, welcome to another episode of Coding with Ado. Today we're going to work with Google Cloud Vision API. So the idea of this Vision API is for us to be able to analyze an image and get some information from it. Let's say, for example, we want to um, analyze an image here. Let's go to my documents and my logo. Another robot. It's analyzing. This is a DALL-E image, so I don't know what's gonna understand here. It's a hat. Yeah. So it's now the return animal for... Oh, well, that's not that bad. Hermione Flesh, Eyelash, Stop Toy, Illustration, Wolf Beach, Whiskers. Well, yeah, kinda. We have the colors, the aspect ratios. Step search adult, very unlikely, spoof, possible, medical, unlikely, wireless, unlikely, and racy, very unlikely. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna use a specific image to trigger one of these because I don't wanna be demonetized and everything. But yeah, the idea of the Vision API is that you can use it for analyzing the images that users upload to your let's say web service, web server, and yeah, see if there's something wrong with it, if you do not allow it for it because of your guidelines. Okay, so let's get started. So in order to do that, let's first create a package. And we're gonna install the Google Cloud Vision package. Take some time. Meanwhile, I'll create the index index.js file. So uh, I'm gonna do let's let's require vision from Google Cloud Vision. Let's create our function to do the analyze image, for example. Okay, and we're gonna do uh, we're gonna connect a vision to our server. So let's do const client equals to new vision dot image animate annotator con client. In here we're gonna send a key file name and as every a Google Cloud application we'll need to add here our JSON file a actual JSON file path. I'll let it in a bit. So after we have the client, we wanna analyze the image here. So let's do, let's say we're gonna send add an image here. Uh, actually, no, sorry, we're gonna add an image here. Okay, we are set it by parameters. So uh, we're just gonna do who? Const result equals to an await of the client dot let's say the label detection um, and we're going to use the image and then let's uh, return that let's wrap all these in a try catch Okay, and let's also here say synchronous function that will cause labels, let's say image, analysis, image, analysis is going to be an await of analyze image 
and let's in here the image and let's do a console log image analyzer nice so also from like label detection you can use the other functions here but for us let's do the label detection you know uh, you can use as to as i showed you before you know save search detection text detection web detection etc but let's do the label detection that's fine for this specific role um actually let's do both we're gonna do result and let's also do let's say labels let's do save search let's respond labels and save search because i'm sure that most of you actually want to need want to know about the self search Okay, so let me bring uh, bring up the image here. Okay, so we have the logo here. Let's do logo.png. And now we need a JSON file path. So let's grab our JSON file path. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna need to go to the console. the Google Cloud Console. We're going to go to the credentials. We're going to create a new service account. Let's call it Cloud Vision. Create and continue. Actually, just done honestly uh, and enable API and services always remember to have that enabled so let's go and enable that uh, it's up here so we need to enable cloud vision Cloud Vision API, enable, okay, so now we go back to the credentials. We go to the Cloud Vision here, we edit it. We are gonna create the keys, add key, create new key, JSON create. And yeah, we have that there. So we now have to move it to here. So I just moved it here to go in with out here and let's run this thing. Oh, actually first we need to modify here and say go in with Add JSON. So now let's run no index.js. Yes. Uh, we forgot to call this anonymous function. It's analyzing. Perfect. So we have the labels, the base annotations, the annotations, the annotations. We have the annotations here, some things, some stuff here, all the labels that we saw before from the try. And then we have the safe search, and you see that very unlikely from adults, possible spool, unlikely medical, unlikely violence, and very likely racing. So yeah, that's basically how you work with these things so thank you very much for staying with me uh, if you like this content like subscribe and if you have some requests for next apis let me know and see you on the next episode bye, -bye.